neighborhood eyesore. Today, Honolulu Mayor Kirk Caldwell allowed a bill aimed at monster homes to become law, but says there are flaws in the bill he can't support. But explained Wednesday afternoon why he could not sign the bill. You think if I sign it, I'm saying I'm in agreement with, with all aspects of the bill, and I'm not. So I think I send a message if I sign it, and then I come back in three or four months to say, well, there's problems with it. It needs to be fixed here. We've been telling the council all along the way, Kathy has, about our concerns and problems. They haven't addressed them. So now I'm in an uncomfortable situation. The problems, Caldwell says, are unintended consequences for legitimate builders. Under the bill, detached dwellings cannot have a floor size greater than 70% of a lot size. The mayor said this bill would force unnecessary mandates for homeowners wanting to renovate existing older homes. I'm not going to veto it because I want to move it forward. So it's an imperfect legislation that I think can be made better. Caldwell also worries the new regulations will create delays in getting building permits from the Department of Planning and Permitting. As they come in, we already have a huge backlog just in permits of all sorts. It slows down. You were trying to speed it up. It slows it down because of the amount of uh, the inspectors having to go and look at all of these things and a lot of discretion and, you know, measuring. And that will just take away time from other permits. Despite the mayor's lack of signature, the bill will go into effect immediately.